three three points today, three 0 win, and you grab the first goal. How do you feel? Uh, I feel good. You know, um, past couple of games not been able to score the way we usually do, getting in behind and getting shots off. But today is a uh, is a little different. You know, we played a bit more attacking, and uh, and you know we were able to to get more shots off. You know, we have more people flying forward, and uh, it was a good, good performance from us all around. And you grabbed the first goal, and it was quite a cracking goal, and a great assist from uh, Brian as well. Uh, did you know the ball was going? To fly to the top corner when it left your feet? Uh, I mean, I, I was just aiming for the corner, you know, keep us kind of off his line. He's, um, made it look better than what it was, I thought, but, you know, it was good work from Bry, you know, it gives you a bit extra because he can come in behind and come to feet and I feel like we just read each other a little bit, you know, just popped it off of his chest and give me enough time to, to take the shot off. Luckily it went in. So the final, that was the final game before this one month lockdown. Are you, you and the lads confident that you can come back and continue this good run of form? Yeah, definitely. I mean, We'll just look back on the performance, you know, after the month, and I'm sure we'll be able to to, to come back, come back flying, you know, and doing what we can do, getting in behind, getting the shots, and you know, our strikers scoring and getting the win, getting the three points. Hopefully, it should, should be good after the month. Mm-hmm. Ben, that was the first clean sheet of the season for you. How yeah. do you feel? Good. Yeah, it's uh, been a bit, a bit frustrating getting back playing at the start of the year. You know, been with Luke a long time and not played for the last couple of years, so. To start playing again and then do my army and then come back and take me a couple of weeks, but yeah, I feel like I'm even yeah. there now. <laughs> you pulled off a few good saves from the top corner, and they're, they're big lad, their main threat, the striker. Where obviously, you were set off as a game a lot easier after he came off. And um, no, I think it's always difficult going out to 10, man. You know, we can go one two ways there, lads can switch off, we can start sitting back a bit, give them a bit more time on the ball, but. I think after Whitchurch as well, when we went down to 10 men, we didn't really take it to them. So I think tonight, as soon as we went down to 10 men, we know we have to get another and get another and just keep going and we do. And you and Adam have started a bit of a competition for the number one spot as uh, Hanley's goalkeeper. Is that is there a bit of banter between you two? Who's going to get the uh, most clean sheets at the end of the season? Or is it just is it more good for yourselves and yeah, to no, keep sharp and stuff? Good lad, that is. He hasn't, he hasn't played for a few years, so he's come in and you know he's, he's trimmed up. And to be fair, you know it's, it's good. It's good that um, it just shows where the club won't be though. If they've got two keepers who you know were good enough to play, you know for for a club of Hamley, there's some teams leagues above that who haven't got that. So it shows where Hamley won't be and where we won't be as a team. So competition is always good wherever it is. Great, cheers, lads. Thank cheers. you.